Okay, welcome back to another one of our Reaper Surround tutorials. This time it's about the use of the LFE, the so-called subwoofer, so this special bass channel, the point 0.1 in the 5.1. Now, uh, normally what you would do is you would use the rear surround pan plugin. I open it for you. And in this function, it, it works for the gain of the five speakers left, right, center, left surround, and right surround. And when we jump to the LFE setting, it jumps to zero since we, we don't put any sound on the LFE yet. And that's how we can use the LFE in this uh, uh, context of the plugin. We think it's better to work different with the subwoofer, meaning what I would do now is I open up the, the sends because we put a sends on every channel you work with in, in the Foley's and, and FX and Atmos. So I press Alt-Shift-S to access the uh, sends. So I have all the sends for the reverbs here. And what I have here is the send for the subwoofer. Now, how is this set up? I go to the routing and I see, okay, my sub is sent from channels one to four and it only goes to channel four. So that's how we set it up. So if we want to use subwoofer, for example, of these footsteps, which of course does not make any sense in, 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 in the contact of this image, but maybe you have some, I don't know, monster footsteps you want to put bass on and then you can use it. So I press command shift and I can move the, the envelope segment. So now I'm going to send volume, I'm going to send a signal into my sub send. So I can play this now. When I go up, I can see that my sub gets uh, audio now on input 4, so on the LFE input. What I can do now is I can open up this FX chain and it's a two in, two out plugin here. It's a limiter at the end and it's set to number four. So only on number four, there is signal uh, inputting in the limiter and again going to the output. What's the advantage of the use of the uh, sub send? In fact, what we can do is we can use uh, subharmonic plugins like the, the Freeware Bark of Dog by Boss Digital Labs. Uh, to You see that, that there is a little difference here, a boost. I can, of course, boost more. If I like to boost more, I can, I can uh, uh, set the value where I want to use it. Of course, up here it doesn't make sense since the, 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 the LFE only goes up to 130 hertz. So I can have it somewhere around here and then I can, I can try out how I find a, a nice sound for my subwoofer channel. I have a bandpass as the next. What it does is it cuts the bass above 130 hertz, which is quite important because I don't want to have a rumble sound above these 130 hertz on my uh, subwoofer channel. In the end, I have a limiter which prevents peaks above minus 3 dB. Okay, that's about it. You can use this send, of course, on every track where, where it's available. So there's one here. There's, of course, on every Foley track, there's uh, this sub uh available. It's a toggle, so I can, by pressing Alt-Shift-S, I can get those uh, envelopes and also get rid of them again if I lack uh, space on my, on my screen. Thanks a lot for watching and on to the next tutorial.